Hey guys, it's me, and we're taking a look at this game called Bendy and the Ink Machine. Uh, somebody commented on one of my FNAF videos about it, and I wanted to take a look. And I really liked it. I have only done the first chapter so far, and in playing, it did kind of take me some looking around to find some of the pieces. So I wanted to do kind of like a little bit of a walkthrough guide, because the pieces that you need do change place. But for the most part, I'm going to be quiet here and only read when I really need to, like here. So we've got Dear Henry, seems like a lifetime since we worked on cartoons together. 30 years really slips away, doesn't it? If you're back in town, come visit the old workshop. There's something I need to show you. Your best pal, Joey Drew. All right, Joey. I'm here. Let's see if we can find what you wanted me to see. You can run by holding shift. I'm trying to remember, I believe. There's this inky mess over here. Ink machine is down here. So this is the ink machine, huh? Wonder how you turn it on. Now if you're like me, you're probably walking all around this machine trying to figure out how to turn it on. Well, that's not how you turn on the ink machine. But pieces can be in here. They can be up here. Here's one of them. Oh, I don't think I can get them yet until I find the other thing. That's right. So we go down here. How about this? Oh my god. Joey, what were you doing? It's pretty great. Boris. Who's laughing now? <laughs> There's another one of the pieces you need. Let's go get the puzzle opened up. It's right here. Alright, how do I get this to work? So here are all the parts, here's all the clues. A lot of these look almost exactly like what you need to find. The only one that's a little confusing is this one um, because they even have a room with a note up on the wall. And I, I was like, there's gotta be something in here, but it's, it's actually a record you're looking for. Okay, so. Now, I always hate that man. Who put this here? Oh, that's actually not one. Thought it was. And I can hide them. Here's the ink. That was in the same spot both times. There's the record. There's the gear. And when you first go through, all these doors are closed, I think. You can go back and open them. There is also a box here. At this point, I don't get what Joey's plan is for this company. The animation sure aren't being finished on time anymore, and I certainly don't see why we need this machine. It's noisy, it's messy, and who needs that much ink anyway? <laughs> also, get this. Joey had each one with donate something from our workstation. We put them on these little pedestals in the break room. To help appease the gods, Joey said. Keep things going. I think he's lost his mind. But hey, he writes the checks. But I tell you what, if one more of these pipes burst, I'm out of here. Now the first time I played the book was on the chair. Oh crap, I missed the, uh, what do you call it, didn't I? The toy. Uh, see, when you have them all, you come here, but I don't have them all yet. Go get the 
kitty. Well, I guess technically it's a bendy, but it looks like a kitty. See, this is that room that caught me off guard. Not sure what this is, but. What does that say? Bacon sour? I don't know, man. Still need the wrench. Now I think the wrench is always here too. That's where it was the last time. Oh, what's the last thing I need? The book. Let's see if we can find it. Don't want to go near the thing. Oh, there it is. Okay, that's all of them. Now I just need to get the ink flowing somehow. Should be a switch around here somewhere. Then I can start up the main power. And go back to that classroom. Now, you want to run back to the beginning. Right here. Whew. Only reason I didn't freak out was because I saw it already. <laughs> that freaked me out the first time. Was not expecting it. Let me just go down here. And there's going to be an axe on the wall that you want to get. This will definitely come in handy. you to step into it. But I don't want to. There you go. That's the whole first chapter. 
it's a bit short um but honestly if you play on your own and you don't look up a guide <laughs> then it'll take a lot longer like a lot longer because i know i was looking around for a while An axe may come in handy, huh? <laughs> so yeah, um, my impressions, I really like it. Um, you don't really find a ton of games like this. I mean, it seems like for a while they were coming out with a lot of them and not so much anymore. Now, it seems like everything is, you know, the sort of like uh, either visceral horror or let's take away their weapons to scare them, which just kind of makes me mad. Like I'm used to more old school survival horror where you actually get a weapon and get to kill your enemies. And I don't like, you know, <laughs> just f running from people. Part, pardon the F bomb. Um, but anyway, I'm definitely interested in this. This is like right up my alley. I know I don't really get a chance to do as much of the horror stuff as I'd like to on my channel. It's hard when there are so many MMOs to cover and I'm constantly juggling the games and the content and making the videos plus real life, you know, so. But I would, I, I wanted to make a video for this because it's only like 10 minutes to make, so. Especially when you know what you're doing. Oh, also, let me mention that this is currently, at least, is for free on Steam. So if you want to try it out, it's free. You're not losing anything. So I'm going to take a look at chapter two and I'll get a video together for you when I'm done. See you guys.